Hello, I'm John Fawcett. I'm the Director of Studies for Computer Science. Uh, the Computer Science Tripos at Cambridge is exciting and it's fast paced and that's one of the reasons I love computer science so much. It combines theory and practice, uh, so that's hardware labs doing uh, some actual hands-on hardware development and software labs developing your own programs in weekly programming classes to really build a deep understanding of what computer science is about as a subject and about what the industry is about um, so that you, you're able to understand the end goal and uh, you can see where the industry is heading. Uh, in the first year of the Tripos we have um, the weekly programming classes and fortnightly hardware labs. Um, we combine that with lectures and our small group teaching which is known as supervisions in Cambridge and we'll look at different programming languages, different styles of programming and then apply that to some operating system development, starting the systems part of the course, and some machine learning, um, starting that strand of the course. So we start to understand how computer science fits into society, and that's very important in an industry that, that is trying to disrupt change, change the way business works, change the way society works. We don't want to just introduce new things and then worry later on about what this, this thing is that we've invented. We want to be able to plan ahead and produce systematic, well thought out changes to society. In the second year of the Computer Science Tripos at Cambridge, we move on to think about uh, compilers. So how, do we, uh, how do we give ourselves the tools as computer scientists to be able to write our programs in higher level languages where it's easier to write correct code, it's faster to develop large programs, and yet we can still compile them into the machine code that the hardware needs to execute. Um, we look at concurrent systems, uh, very important in today's world with multiple computers, multiple CPUs within one computer. How do we build applications that actually take advantage of that parallel hardware and go faster rather than just generate more heat? But we also develop the, the theory part of computer science a lot more in the second year. Um, in the first year we do some discrete maths, which is the, the basic tools we need. But in the second year we apply that to what we call semantics of programming languages. Um, that goes into the third year. As you look at quantum computing, you extend your computing framework with, of course, some currently future-looking uh, concepts so you can see that the computer science tripos is very theoretical, it's also very practical, and it's bringing those two together to giving, giving everyone a really broad and deep understanding of the field. And this is what computer science is about, this is why it's such an exciting, fast-paced subject, this is why I hope you'll apply to, to the college and study computer science here with us.